um, flatbread pizza, spicy hot dog with pineapple chutney and plantain chips. This is what I want. And it even says on the other side, Flower Epcot International Flower Garden Festival. Good fortune. Let's see what they have. We've never been back here really. Some air conditioning in here. It's hot outside. Ooh, what is this? Who are those? Are those supposed to give you good luck? Oh, Year of the Tiger. These are nine ninety five. Seven ninety five. Oh, well, this is nine ninety five. Hmm. Beer. Oh, yeah, that is a different one. Thank you. Boba tea. Why are you saying it's the year of the ram then? Uh, that's 2015-2027. Someone tell us which year is it? Which zodiac year? Seven, I just told you it's the year of the tiger. Oh, is it the year of the tiger? Yeah, that's what that thing said. Oh, that's why they had tigers. Okay, and it's, now it's all makes sense. Ha happy Lunar New Year. Right here. Okay, and then they even got the ears. No, look at that. Yeah, that's why t tiger. See, you're the tiger. Uh -huh. Duh. Jeez. See, here's the 2022 calendar. See? It's so pretty in here. These little things hanging off the ceiling. Oh, look, it's Kermit on the toilet. No, I don't think that's Kermit. <laughs> oh, maybe not Kermit, but... A frog. It's a frog. <laughs> I guess it's not Kermit, but it's a frog. Oh, that's cute. All the little frogs. Not cute. Outside of China, well actually outside of the store, they have all these little figurines. Guys, China was good for me. I like this. That was cool. Look at the ox. And here is the year of the tiger. with Tajin sauce on it. Now someone told us last year this was really good, so I want to actually try it. Mm. It's got a sweep from the pineapple and then like a zang, like a sweet zing or zangy, like a tang. Got a tang to it. Saying a tang but with a very sharp zinc spice to it. Yes. But it's really good and it's fresh pineapple. Does it balance each other up? Yeah. On a scale of one to ten, level of spiciness. It's not spicy. Not spicy at all? It's tangy. Like a like a There's like a slight spice to it. Yes. Try again. <laughs> Yeah, and I want to know where I can find this spice, this Tajin stuff. It's really good. This would be good on any type of fruit, I think. Especially like an orange or something. 
And it, you would think it would be like a sour sweet, but it's not. How, uh, how much that cost? I think it was $4.75. Pressure on a hot summer day here in Florida. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, technically hot spring day. <laughs> Feels like summer. What is it? Oh, like, what is it? A Venus flytrap. And what does that do? It's a carnivorous plant that just it opens up and it waits until a fly gets in there and it just closes it. Oh. And then the acid will dissolve the fly cool. and it'll suck up on the nutrients. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Isn't this cool looking? Look at this one. Pretty cool. Some really unique things here. Oh yeah, look, here it is. Venus flytrap. There's another one. There's another carnivorous plant right here. Where what's this one? Like Get a shot of the tube. See the little tube? Right, right, yeah. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Where the insect will get tricked to get in there in the tube mm-hmm. and they get caught and it closes the lid and it, it'll dissolve the, the, the bug. Oh, that's kind of neat. So I think, I don't know. So if you had like a house <laughs> with a pool or something, that might be a good. Yeah. And then they got some cute little plants over here. A white jade, miniature white jade. They're really cool. A lavender flower. And a jupiter, or juniper. Very cool. They have some of these unique little. So lots of cool little flowers and stuff they have here. Now I don't know if this booth is here year round or if this is just here for the festival, I'm not sure. Brazilian rain tree over there. Oh. Oh, what's a rain tree? What does that do? Sunny or shade indoors in a bright window pruned to shape of fertilize in the early spring to promote new growth. Keep moist. This tree is sensitive to Oh heat. yeah, Hold I've up. seen this on um, documentaries where you see the shape of the leaves? At night they, sh- they close. You actually see them uh, slowly fold like a, an umbrella. Let's see if I can get this in focus. That's cool. I've never, I, I never, never seen one in real life before. Oh, so that's kind of cool. Oh, a Chinese elm. All kinds of exotic plants from all over a the world. A dwarf. A dwarf skulls. Leaf. How do you say that? Shalifra? Chef. Chef Lara. And then the bonsai tree. The bonsai sign. Very cool. neat. Yeah. Hmm. Look, they have a money tree for good luck and prosperity. Upon uh, Germany, and this is the farmer's market with some potato pancakes um, with different things in them. A toasted pretzel bread and warm cheese strudel. That's what they look like. So we're walking into this store where it is always Christmas in here. Let's walk in here. Let's see what they all have. Ginger Cottage. And here is the um, pickle tree. It is a German tradition that you hide a pickle in your tree and somebody has to find it. Look at all the intricate detail work on this little wooden block here. Oh, yeah. It's cool. This one has the little reef on it, which is kind of cool. And then they have some ornaments over here. And then look, 
Then we have Mickey inside his little wreath. And all these little plushes. I think that's what these are. These are the Disney Munchkin. Look, Eeyore. Oh, it's Eeyore. Odd seeing him here though, right? Yeah, I don't German. know. It's not really exactly Christmas yeah. themed, <laughs> but okay. I was looking to see why it was. No. Didn't say. Maybe it's like a German brand. Maybe. Maybe that's what it is. It's Forty dollars. Yeah, it looked like it's probably a German brand. That's probably why. Wow. Uh, okay. Sounds good. Well, let's keep walking this way. Here's another pickle tree. Little snow globes. Little snow globes. And then these little plates. And we've got some mugs. Mm hmm got the pickles. And some more of these little snow globes. This is like Mickey with like a pretzel and a gingerbread man. Kind of cool. Yeah, we got. These are some glass little ornaments that are cute. Got a lot of um, design in them. It's got the lights and everything. Very good with the detail. And they have hearts. one with the pretzel and the snowman and then here's bigger pre um, pickles to put in your tree the skull in this tree it's kind of cool that's cool too and here is the uh, the seven dwarfs look at this where you see snow white right there follow this little path right there to the house Oh yeah, there is. There's a tiny little Snow White. I don't know if you can see her, but she's right in there. Straight ahead. And look at all the flowers around it. How pretty. They do have a lineup of concerts, and tonight it's the Guess Who that will be here playing which is pretty cool. And they play right here in this little, um, in this uh, theater. We are over here in Magnolia Terrace. And what I wanna try is these grilled oysters with Cajun butter. Um, so we're gonna try that and I think that is it we got the seafood broiled the last time we were here it was good but I want to try something different and they did not have these grilled oysters the last time pretty cool they do the oysters right here on the grill which is pretty cool so this is the grilled oysters and it even comes with a little Tabasco bottle now, I'm not going to put it on there because I've had enough spice today. I'm afraid to have the Tabasco, but it's a cute little idea. All right, so let's give these bad boys a try. And these have like a Cajun butter on them. So it's already got enough spice for me on it. So let's go on and try with the Cajun butter. And it even comes with a, a towelette. Oh my gosh. I think these are the best oysters I've ever had. I'm not kidding. You could taste that Cajun spice, but just a hint of it. And the butter makes it so like smooth. And a hint of the onion. This is perfect. I would have him try these, but he's not a oyster person. No. All right, definitely give this a thumbs up. The 
funnel cake booth and their flavor of the month is the strawberry cheesecake funnel with strawberry ice cream, cheesecake crumbles, strawberry drizzle and whipped cream for $10.50. Smells wonderful.